Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to my Morecambe FC versus Bradford City match vlog. If you do go on to enjoy today's video, please make sure to drop a like on there for me. If you could try to hit 150 likes on today's video, that would be massively appreciated. Subscribe if you are new as well. We are on the road to 8,000 subscribers, so please make sure you are subscribed if you haven't already with that post notification bell on. It's free to do so and it does massively help out. Get a comment in as well down in the comment section down below. Let me know down below your thoughts on today's game. It's obviously the return of Derek Adams and more importantly, the return of Jan Songo against Bradford City. The first time that we've faced up against Derek Adams since he was obviously sacked as Bradford City manager. There's been a lot of media attention about the whole narrative and all that sort of stuff. So fingers crossed we can get one over him in today's game. In terms of a score prediction, I'm going to go with a 3-1 win for the Bantams. I think Andy Cook's going to get a brace. Tyler Smith will find himself on the score sheet and Jan Songo will probably pop up with a header from a corner, something like that. Make sure to drop a like on there for me. Subscribe if you're new as well and I shall see you all once team news is out. Here we have it then, here's how we line up for today's game away at Morkham. We're sticking with the 3-4-3, 3-5-2 system. It's great to see Richards get his first competitive start for the football club after only signing yesterday. I can't say I'm happy to see the back three still. Or your Goke in there as well is a bit of an interesting shout in my opinion. The bench looks very, very weak. Fingers crossed though we can get the three points. Let's get into kickoff. Bring out the Bantams! Bring out the Bantams! Bring out the Bantams! Shit! Derrick Adams! Oh, what can it be? 
like what we had in the opening day where it's a yellow card for any type of foul both ways as well just ridiculous man oh offside really <laughs> There's half time. Fans absolutely furious of that terrible first half boring defensive performance again. So defensive and boring half time. Markham and Derek Adams won. Bradford City and Mark Hughes nil. Change at the break. Hearing Kelly off. Kevin McDonald on. Back four finally. Changing formation. Hopefully Hughes is now walking up. Come on. Let's get the win.
Come on, sit down. Come on, sit down. Come on, sit down. Come on, sit down. change Richards off who's been his best player and we're bringing Ryan out on. That's an absolutely criminal so I don't care how unfit he is. Fourth change, Smallwood off, Bobby Poynton on. Cook gets the armband, Poynton coming on for his senior debut. One of the only positives to come out of today's game. Come on ball in. Oh my god, simple five yard pass. Ahead of you, moron! Maybe stay on your line next time. Fifth and final change of the game, Smith off, Derbyshire on. What on earth is he doing? That's embarrassing. He's not good enough to play Sunday League, never mind for this football club. somehow enjoyed watching make sure you like comment and subscribe i think it's time for change from top to bottom can we just have the whistle put us out of his misery please ref patterson's the only one who seems interested Boo!